Alrighty then. Uh, one thing that I've been wondering about is uh, <coughs> is if if everything now happened about half an hour early, does that mean the battle will end about a half an hour early? Part of me wish so, but uh, another part wish not so. But then again, you know. Oh my goodness. Again, you have him surrounded. Just go get him. There we finally go get him. Oh come on. They're pulling back, okay? Let's do that so. It's not that hard to your charge, you need to do like yeah, come on. Oh, they're retreating. I goddamn hope so. Well, that aside though. Uh... Right, uh, let's see. Where am I actually needed? Here because I have new troops, but I'm really back to this guy. Gonna have to move forward. Who's this? And who's this? Oh, okay, and that's someone weird. Okay. Uh, no, I'm not gonna move. I'm not sure where he belongs. Sure about that. Get back information. I feel that the Prussians are gonna have fail completely. But yeah, I, I am needed here, but I really should go check on the uh, British line. They are pushing back these horsemen quite finely, though. Finely. And uh, nicely. And I should take one last look at the. Uh, no, not Papelot. Um, Plasenoit, or whatever it's called. Plasenoit, we're gonna call it. And we almost have a hundred thousand. Took the entire battle. Right. <clears throat> These guys have been, have been fighting them tired. Jeez. Then again, cavalry do tire quickly because they are running and fighting a lot. So yeah. Where are you guys going? Where is everyone? Oh. Maybe I'm focusing on uh, too wide of a front, perhaps, but... Hmm. Probably too... Better... I think it's better. Oh, jeez. They are beating the... Damn, right. <laughs> Russian. 
I have wrench. Damn. He might need reinforcements, though. Let's get him into a square. All right. Uh, where? What's it? Uh, where is the? He's there. Okay, he has lost like four thousand men already. Oh damn! But he, he, he's giving a beating instead of taking. That's good. I don't know how they're giving me the uh, I have engaged uh, messages. I'm not even their uh, brigade or. Okay. I'm not even their division or corps commander. Jeez. Uh, yeah, these guys need a bit more reinforcements. Okay. Um, where are you? There you are. Of course, there. Uh, I'm gonna take control over you, though. I'm gonna. Why are you deploying like this? And I'm gonna have to order you. Actually, actually I don't have to order you anything, but. You would be so kind to move this way. Oh god, I'm tired. Damn, they're getting hit like damn who? That what happens when you get too close. Artillery, they kinda start pounding you. Okay, so I'm gonna stay one still. That nice little thing on the top of the back there. You deployed over here, actually. How's it going over here? Hmm, what are you doing? All right, sort of. Cavalry units around. Wait, are you? Okay, it's so actually dealing more damage than he gets. That's sweet. Absolutely wonderful. Uh, what am I? Okay, I'm close enough so I should be seeing everything. Everyone is moving. Great. Hold on, there was another artillery piece back here somewhere. So this is gonna be battery rich and it is a or height I don't know what you're gonna call it. Rich height. Yeah battery battery heights. Sounds better. Actually yeah it's a light of cannon. And we'll say bye bye to these guys.
I'm not gonna come back. Okay, you won't be able to move faster right now. Uh, right. <clears throat> and once you're actually there, you uh, march in behind, I think. Hmm. Oh, now we're gonna have to start the rows a little. I can't. I can't take them on a long way around. Hmm. It's not exactly chances of the oldest. Uh. But you know, I can do it. Just that I have to cross over and then start marching. Yeah, you know what? I think I cannot take that risk. Ah. Now for that I have to move even further away from uh, the British line. But yeah, and that's the thing I would really like to see. I mean, you know, you just take a, you know, like any unit and you just say walk there, or you know, you can give them like a path to follow, like go. Go here and then down, then up. Would be nice. Oh well. Um, we are still giving a beating and taking one. Look at that. God damn. Yeah, they are taking a beating up here. Jeez. But it doesn't matter too much because I have more guys incoming. guys are gonna be detached. Yeah, let's detach you from any other orders. And I think... Oh, which road should we follow? Uh, you can follow the road through here, I think. Give me a check. Yeah, we're gonna have to cross over first. Cross over the river. Not just down to the river, it's across it and up again. Actually, it's up here in this formation. Everything looks to be alright down there. So far. If I were to do a um, attack in here now, that would be wonderful. But as of now, I am going to walk this brigade all the way down here somehow. I don't even know if I can actually walk that far. Uh, right. This is a huge risk. Actually, just deploying them like in the woods somewhere is probably enough. You know, walking them like up uh, where it would it be? And here in this crossroad, there would be enough. Can I even go that far? Probably not. Not even close. <laughs> where are you going? Hey, look at that! And, huh? 
He has given a goddamn smack. Jeez. Jeez. This man not good. Everything seems to have been quiet down here a little bit though. Why are the commanders so far behind the beast? So yeah, once I actually get back to the British line, I'm gonna order this one, this side forward, and strengthen it over here, because I got a feeling that the old guard might be coming soon. Like very, very soon. You kind of sad that I can actually see, you know, oh, this is uh, a reg cavalry regiment. It would be. Be more tense if I didn't know what the hell it was until I actually saw it. You know, like hmm. Put that aside, though. Uh, so I have to get a little bit closer, and we almost won this battle by the points. Yeah, these Prussians are doing really well. What's going up here? They don't have enough men up there, and I remember now that I actually had one on... Uh, take the charge. Where did you go? It appears I have driven... Uh, not really though, they're still out there. And the last few you can hurry into position. I could bring them up in behind, but that would not give me too much uh, maneuverability. Kind of take the path that I want them to take. Sweet. At least this guy. Uh, 
I think I would actually have time to ride back over to the British line and order order them down a little. I think this is gonna have to be another one hour episode. <sighs> The 45,000 have died so far, and a little plus. Yeah, this guy is gonna need help. Probably gonna be the most tactical maneuver I ever tried me on so far. Right. Um. So how should we do this? <coughs> gonna need a lot of cavalry, and cavalry we have quite a few on the flanks. We just have to bring them in, and then followed by the cavalry. And we'll probably just see what's going on here as well someday. And we have a hundred thousand. God damn. Okay, you have actually moved towards the okay. end. That's alright. Still think you should move over here though. See, if you can make do it like that, then the square will actually protect the... Uh, the line infantry. How can you tell? Is that Landwehr together with. It looks like Landwehr at least. I know for a fact that you all rested. Okay, no, you're not. Uh, you guys, though, seems to be quite alright. Oh, come on, a little bit closer. Actually, a hell of a lot closer. Cabri's still going on there. And as I said, I think if I launch an attack on uh, Hugemont and La Haye Saints, that uh, Napoleon won't have men to actually feed into it, even though he might actually have gotten more men, but or two more. I think he has to get two more uh, cores down here. Now that aside.
there we are. And these guys actually ran out again. Not okay, the place you hear them. Right, and we are in contact with our original army again. Wonderful. Right, and we have a lot of cavalry, I thought. Might actually get a few points here. Nice. Right, gonna hurt up a little bit again. Actually, we're gonna slow down a little. You can actually move a bit this way. And we are going to move everyone forward. So, and so, ah, oh, he only got 15 men, <laughs> oh wow, well you can stay back then, I hope I'm not uh, putting them in, you know, okay, they're gonna do it like that, hopefully they don't stuck on each other actually
Right here seems to be quite over. I just know that one or few of my regiment have been pounded to hell with artillery. Okay, no, it's French. There's the Prussians. Let's see how this goes. Ah, never mind. I got a battle to uh, take care of that one. Uh, right. Um, these guys are not tired yet. No, they're relatively fresh. the uh, flank commander is here. You, and you command... whom exactly? Mm, no idea. Right, uh, as I said, we can probably take back Hugemont. No, yeah, yeah, and Hugemont and this. Mr. Rhodes. And you can probably get out of square. Quite sure who the hell I ordered right there. Yes. Yeah, I will, a whole square have been pounded with bloody smithereens and a lot of two squares actually. Quite a few, holy shit. Yep, a lot of squares have been pounded and that's the other one. My cavalry, I have no idea what those guys are. All right, we're gonna pull your pull you back. It was a dreadful endeavor. Well, mainland don't have any. Infantry to do that famous charge now. Or, never mind. Um, right. All my cavalry is done, it appears. Or just haven't done stuff. One out of two. This side is moving. Hopefully, we can kind of right.
Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, everyone is killing. Oh my goodness. Or is it? A little bad it is, perhaps. Yeah, but you know, seeing like one, two, three, four, five squares have been found in smithereens. No, no, no. That's bad, 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 very, very bad. Well, the French horses has died quite a lot, though. Even if they have a whole brigade still. It appears these guys are redeploying, though. Oh, not this. Uh, right, I have no cavalry in reserve at all. Okay, I have some battered one, but, but. Okay, it's time to actually head back down. There. Oops. So. So yeah, that was a huge loss of manpower there for no reason really. Actually, I think you can if you quick about it. And, uh, <clears throat> oh yeah, where's the cavalry? Come on. Probably a little over aggressive, but I think that this is actually what's needed. Make contact with the Prussians, so Probably should let the uh, Prussians deal with attacking, but hmm. Right, that aside though. Nothing like helping your allies though. And you are. Where? Come on. There you go. Okay, they decided it is a bit too dangerous, and it probably is. Right, so it's seven, almost quarter over seven. Well, it's seven, never mind. Um, Everyone's order should is to attack, right? No, not. Attack, 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 attack. Should 
probably moves with cavalry over here. I am actually doing that, I think. They should be starting to pour fire. Okay, never mind. Thought they would. This is gonna probably drain points and or manpower. But look at that huge advance. We have sort of shorting on, shorting our line, but mm. hopefully not. But enough about that. We have a division that is waiting on us to give an order. This uh, battery might actually get shoot up. This one didn't do as well as uh, this guy over Getterish or what, whatever his name is. He have lost quite a few men, and he is taking on... Actually, they have done better. I might have gotten myself into a giant cluster fuck, but... Hmm, I'm willing to do that. Look at that, holy shit, a major British advance! <laughs> he has a goddamn cavalry over here. Damn. I have no cavalry reserves up there. Right, um... Why haven't you deployed? 
Right, and uh, that aside, where is where is your commander? So. Hmm. Oh, they have taken some casualties. God damn. How is uh, this guy doing? Gesh, whatever his name is. Yeah, I've been doing all right. Doing pretty well. How many points do I get from this? Uh, let's see if I can see this guy. Confused on which side I was looking at. Uh, right, let's uh, move your asses this way. We might actually end up losing equal amount of soldiers, and a lot of them have died already. Right, um, things are drawing to a close, it's almost 18 o'clock, actually almost 17.30. See, that's why I didn't want to send this one guy's division up here, because it would just clump up even more. But in doing so, I actually have to march. I actually have to write personal quite far. Then a lot of that Frenchmen, not so many Russians by the looks of it, but there are Prussians. You know, I'd be right back, I'm gonna have to check it. I just remembered that I had something on the stove. Luckily, this time at least, it was very low heat on. <laughs> no, no alarms or anything. That would have been annoying. Right, that aside though, we can actually signal, signal this guy. It appears that he's actually already had engaged with his artillery. Now they're really clumping up, but that's all right because the British are here. <laughs> all right. Oh, there's a giant gap there. Uh, moving the artillery up. Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. 
do so somehow. Reorganizing it. Ah, he have lost all his cavalry buff. I probably have one unit out there. Somewhere. He is moving forward. It's not going to be a massive stroke, but you know it's going to get into the flank, hopefully. And that, in turn, might actually not get going to clump us up even more, but hopefully not that much. That artillery is a nice use target. Where are you going? I never knew I had these many troops on uh, the ridge. Damn. Uh, right, um, probably move some caber this way if I can find some. Which I currently can't. There, there's some. Oh, it's you, hello. Alright then. And if you any more minor adjustments I can do before I actually call it quit. Yeah, I can move the artillery a bit further up even more. Alright, we're gonna order you then. Wait, his artillery was attached. No it was not. Right. Mm-hmm. And you are passing your stuff. When the old guard attacks, I'm gonna have to ride over there if they attack. I might actually have bogged them down, who knows. <laughs> um, probably not though, I think they actually start over here. So yeah. What's that? 11. Hmm, those are the guards, I think, yes. These guys have been just been sitting there. <laughs> like, yeah, okay. Yeah, we took, we took a trip to uh, populate this area. Right then. 
to use every second we have left to actually just check everything. Oh wow, look at that. Jeez. So much cavalry and they all turning away. Hate it. Absolutely hate it. Come on. Your orders are to attack. And you should attack. It is essential that you attack. I don't know. That's such a great idea. Uh, right, either way. I think we're sort of short in our line, but not enough. And this guy is slamming into uh, the flanks here, I hope. And he's appearing at least. Oh shit, the British infantry is here already. Jeez. Uh, right, I think actually... Uh, yeah, let's see. I think this is the... Yeah, this is the guard cavalry, isn't it? I might actually be hand getting myself a hip beating here. Yeah, the cap is just absolutely haywire. So not such a great move after all, but hey ho. Oh shit, yeah, I'm just getting everyone into a narrow bundle funnel here. Bit of tunnel vision. Uh, let's bring you guys here. So, along with you ones. Should be an easier target. Right, okay, they drove them off. Nice. There's still artillery up there though. Pounding us somewhere. And we are a little bit overdue, I see. I, uh... Ooh, this is gonna be a slaughter fest. Holy shit. I don't think we're even gonna break the French line. Here are the stars, uh, okay. Uh, that aside though, I hope you all enjoyed. I most certainly have. Probably should have stayed in line, but mm, you know me. Not the cleverest, not the smartest, but you know, I'm willing to take risks.